our first vaccine done. Oh, I hate needles. And do you give consent to your vaccine? Too? Yes. Yep. So that's it, that's the calf sold. Woo! We are doing a bit of organising, aren't we, Ben? The thing with our house is a big house and there's four bedrooms. There's two of us. Yeah. And so three cats. We're starting, we've got, what is it, five weeks until we go? Yeah. Four weeks until people move in, so today's the 13th of... Yeah, it's like a month and a couple of days, isn't it? It's 13th of June today, and we've got someone moving in the 10th of July, and then we're going travelling 17th of July. So we're just going to start by doing a room a week, aren't we? So we're starting yeah. this room, which is probably the room of the least stuff in. <laughs> Trying to get as rid as much crap as possible. <laughs> possible. Ben feels like yeah. shit, he's been off work here all week. We think it's a vaccine. Got someone clearing the garage tomorrow, so we're trying to load up the stuff that we don't need. Do not drop it on that car. <laughs> oh, look at him showing off. So, this is the before. That's before we're gonna we're paying someone 200 quid to empty this all out and then when we go traveling we can use it for our storage oh and just to top it off i bled to death now nah, i cut my finger on a bit of glass so i finished work today and then we decided to do a bit of packing so we've packed up a few rooms we've emptied out that under the stairs so it's four and a half weeks till we go travelling today and we've already started packing and clearing up the house. And what have we booked? Uh, we booked an overnight train, Chernobyl. Um, and our departure flight. And flight, yeah. Which is? So our flight is the 17th of July, Saturday morning at 7 o'clock from Luton Airport in London. And my dad's hopefully going to take us. So... We've got just over four and a half weeks to get this house empty, four bedroom house, my add, empty before the 17th. So Ben's lying on the floor trying to book our Airbnb for Kiev because the one we booked got cancelled, didn't it? So I'm packing, but I'm struggling now. So that is just our bedroom. There's not really nothing to do in there. In here, I ain't really done much. I've got been a few bits, but... What do you do with like makeup and things like that? I don't know, what to, where do I put my perfume? I'm gonna give my um, watches to my dad to put. That's all we've got done. And then in here, just like piles of things, piles of things. This is all clothes to go to the charity shop. So we drove all the way to London to get our second vaccine done. So we have it done before we go traveling. And the car park we parked in is the shopping center. So and I can go shopping in London. Most expensive. Oh, I've ever seen oh my god, £3.20 an hour, it's a joke. So it'll be a very quick visit. Yes, but we've got to find a vaccine centre now. We've drive to a walk-in clinic, whatever you call them, to have our second one done. We've got, so. we've got to wing it a little bit anyway. So we're not... Well, we've only been three weeks since our last one, should but we should be all right. Yeah, yeah it's three to twelve weeks, so hopefully, fingers crossed, they let us have it. London was worth it in the end, Ben. All systems go there now. Yeah. And what was it? An hour wait in the queue as well, so. Now. Worth it, though, it's done. Yes, and we can do a bit of shopping now as well. I think there's a Zara and HM here. Shopping in London! Oh, I'm so excited! Packing away the kitchen, all of our beer. So these are from our old house. 
All out of date, isn't they? That's 2019. Yeah. 2017. <laughs> so all of these, we've already got some in the sink. We could have had, we could have had like a gone off beer night, couldn't we? Oh, imagine the bellyache though. Yeah, it's all heat in it. <laughs> Away. All part of packing. Shows you how much we don't drink. Could have given it all away to the homeless, couldn't we? No, should give a bellyache. Yeah, I suppose. Shit. Whoops. Whose idea was this? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> close your eyes. Yeah, close your eyes. Turn my eyes out. Well, it's a bit orange, isn't it? That's what happens, isn't it? Really? A little bit. Football's coming home. Football's Good packing, Ben. Thank you. Look at that straight box. Look at that. I think it's enough tape, Ben. No, it's not. Oh, watch out for Flea. <laughs> Booted him in the face. <laughs> Sorry, Flea. Oh, he's under enough pressure of us moving. So this is our house. And there's our garage. And this is where we can st we're storing all our stuff when we go, so it's quite handy. No, let's put that back further. Put it back on that one. On the tumble dryer. Oh my god. I could have say that. Bye house. Bed for the night. You make the bed. <laughs> so today is literally the last day, well, last night in our house. It's now, I think, 7.30 in the evening. We've literally just stopped packing and we've upstairs is completely empty. We've done that. We've took all the rooms empty. There's one room filled with um, the new tenant stuff, which is a friend and they're going to look after our cats. Um, but yeah, all the upstairs rooms are all empty now. Um, we're sleeping in the front room tonight. We just brought the mattress down. So all we've got to do is throw that in the garage tomorrow. And the kitchen's got our like last minute like um, bits that are going to my dad's. Hey, come on England! Woo! When we've recorded this, this is... What's the date? The 9th. 9th of July, so England's in the final on Sunday, so... We might have won by the time you see this video! I'm sleeping in the front row. It's like Flea knows and wants cuddles. Hello, Flea Flea. Hello. Right, so Portsmouth. Up to London. Over to... Kiev. Stay there for a little while, over to Levy, train down to Odessa. Where's Odessa? You can pass it there. There. And then we're going. Coach. Coach to Moldova, which is there. Coach to. We haven't booked that yet, but no. that's where we plan to go. Yeah, Bucharest. Coach or overnight train. And then we're flying over to Istanbul. Couple of nights in Istanbul. And then flying over to Cappadocia. A week in Cappadocia ish. Yeah. Lebanon. Oh, are we? Yeah. This is new to me. Yeah, this is what I'm saying. Beirut. Alright, everyone. Get your body armour. I didn't know anything about this. This is new, so. <laughs> and Croatia. And that's yeah. flying. Yep. And then we'll spend probably the last of our six week trip and fly home to London. Yeah, and then we'll go back to London. London. And Someone will pick us up, take us to Portsmouth. Yep, and then we fly to Singapore. Mm. Yeah. So small, Singapore. And that flight for us from England is how long? It's like 18 hours, isn't it? No, I think it's 13. 13 hours. Oh, that's, said, yeah, Australia, isn't it? Yeah, we said we might split it in two, so where could we stop on the way? The flight we were looking at, we could stop in, um, oh, what was it called, Ben? Gives a B? Um, oh, Bahrain. Where's that? 
So we're ready tomorrow, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, so we'll probably Could go. get a flight, yeah. stop off there one night. That's quite a nice airport, Bahrain, isn't it? Yeah, and then fly over to Singapore. And then we're going to Indonesia. So that's... So we're now at the end of September, this will be. Yeah. Yeah, so then we'll go there. That's Bali. And then we'll go to the Philippines. Up there. To South Korea. Thailand. Oh, listen to me, we're going yeah. to Thailand. We've we'll been see, to Thailand before. We'll see my uncle. Oh, yeah. My, uncle, uh, my yeah. uncle lives in Thailand. Then we're going to go to Australia. Um, probably somewhere down here, but I'll just put it there. Up, yeah. And then over to New Zealand. And to New Zealand. So if we wanted to fly home from New Zealand, it is, how long was it? Like nearly 24 hours, isn't it? Yeah. So it was all, more than that, wasn't it? It's all the way over there. So we go back to London. Yeah. So that is half of our year planned up yes. to December. That's it, Ben. I know, well. Everything in the garage, handed over the keys to the new tenants, and we're officially homeless. <laughs> Sounds weird, doesn't it? Yeah. We've moved in at Dad's. Look at the state of it. Probably how much stuff we've brought around. <laughs> you are? We've got a video a bit of our leaving, do haven't we? Since Out for a few drinks before we leave, aren't we, Ben? Yeah, I'm on the hard stuff. Who can, how many you had? Three already? Yeah, but there's only cold cars. You're only driving, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah. You'll be drunk on one. Yeah, but it's five and drive, so I can... I can You're not driving, by the way, people. I can... Drive. He's going in a taxi. <laughs> yeah, we don't promote drink driving on this channel. And we don't promote... Drugs. But they do help. They do help, yeah. Good. Come on then. What well, do you want me to say? What do you want? You want to give it the big? Go. Oh, Six Paul five, Smith. Seven. I'm from uh, Paul Smith. No, Six not. five from seven. M originally from Emsworth. Proud. Got married to <laughs> married to this beautiful woman Kerry. We gave birth to that. Actually even got much beers left. And the other Ball's coming home. Get a picture of us. And which did you go? He's there, but be careful. We well, watch him. Yeah, yeah, we don't care because we can't put it in Talk about football <laughs> coming home. You get the taxi, go to the. Uh, then one night in Rome. Yeah. Curry at the end of the beers. <laughs> They're behind us, are they? You've been vlogged. You've been vlogged. They're not on the vlog. Though. You are, vlogged. you are now. No, we never have been though. You've always been your family, isn't it? It's because you're boring. <laughs> oh, it's boring. Uh, there's Boring John. Yeah, Boring John. Yeah. Six, <laughs> five, seven. <laughs> Six, five, seven. <laughs> so we are trying to book our next flight from Romania to Turkey. And we're just trying to suss out the bag situation. So most places that you have um most airlines have hand luggage allowance for free so this airline pegagoose so i say it pegagoose pegagoose pegasus allows you free hand luggage but it has to be 55 by 40 by 20 which we found most airlines let you but we there we yeah. had to pay extra because that was like ridiculous so it's our bag we're measuring our bag I better put the hard bit in there. So we've measured the length and it's 60 and we're only allowed 55. So what we're doing we're cutting it. is we found that it has like a plastic hard back, which we like because obviously it helps in your back. Yeah. So we're cutting five centimetres off. <laughs> Measure it. Um, I'm hoping. Yeah, 56, I'll give it that. 50, right. Length is allowed 55, and we just cut the back and make it shorter. Width is allowed 40. 40, I don't know. 40, but it's only like, no, 30, but it's only 20. So. So yeah, we checked our bag and we think we're all right. So this is our travel bag. We've got zip at the top. We haven't really explored it properly, have we? No, it's like loads and loads of little, little pockets. pockets and then you can tie it and it's waterproof. And you can get in from the bottom as well. So you don't have to get waterproof coverage, you've got a pocket there. 
pockets full of waters and then you can unzip the bottom and get to all your stuff at the bottom and reach out there so yeah, this is our bag. We just bought it from JD, didn't we? No, uh, spo uh, sports, sports, sports direct, direct sports. and it was like thirty odd quid. Yeah, that's that one. Yeah, so yeah, hopefully these work. We have no idea. So, all right. So in this um, video, we're going to explain to you how we afforded to travel for the year. So I bought a calf in twenty seventeen. Um, always been a full time chef. That's why I bought a calf. Yeah. So I wanted to run it, run it for four years. Did really well, didn't we? Made money, ticked over, COVID hit, it was hard. Um, but we finally sold it, it took us over a year though, didn't it? Because yeah. it was over COVID. Finally sold it, made a bit of profit on it, and got our money back, we invested in it. So win-win in the end. Mm -hmm. So that's part of the money we've, well, that's pretty much most of the money <laughs> that's helping us travel, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty much, they, we took pretty much most money from that, then we? So. Yeah, and we've like, obviously we plan to, Probably the beginning of lockdown, March 2020? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah it would be March 2020, we decided we wanted to go travel. So any money we've made, we've just put away. So I think we used your wages to pay the bills and then my yeah. wage, we... Yeah, we've rented the house away. out, so we have a little bit of money from that, but um, that's sort of paying the mortgage, isn't it? Anyway. Yeah, it pays a mortgage and then it pays, like, you still got your phone bills, then we've got mm. travel insurance, Utilities. life insurance. Yeah. Things like that, so but we've tried to cut down all bills. We've got rid of Netflix, so we'll use more mum and scout. Yeah, <laughs> but hopefully, we won't be using it traveling the world. No, no, but you know, yeah. So, we both self employed after I sold the calf. I just went and did a self employed cleaning job for a few months to earn just a bit of cash to put away for traveling. You was Windows, but I was Windows and I was ducked in for the last year, yeah. And it was it's just. It, yeah, just to get by and that we just... Self-employed as well, so we, neither of us were in proper committed jobs. Nah. So we decided we both quit our jobs last week. Uh, last I, day was last I was, week. Yeah, it was the week before, wasn't it? Yeah, so we both quit our jobs and we're living at my dad's for the last week before we go travelling because we've rented our house out. They moved in last Saturday, didn't they? Yeah. And yeah, on Saturday we leave to go to Ukraine. Hmm. And we've only planned about four weeks. We've got ideas of what we want to do. Yeah, we're going to wing it anyway. It's just going yeah, to be yeah. a lot. There's going to be a lot of mistakes and stuff, but whatever, isn't it? Oh, it's, definitely with us. Yeah. Let's just say that last time we went to London, we left our suitcase on the train. <laughs> but yeah. we won't go there. Yeah, but we can't be doing things there because. And we, we didn't get it back. Yeah, we didn't, did we? And that had beer, that beer in it as well. Beer? Yeah, it had cans of beer in it. Is that all you're worried about? Is oh, beer? Yes. It had a full bottle of perfume in it. <laughs> and my 18th birthday jewellery in it. And my night out outfit. 18th birthday? Hell. I wasn't 18 at the time, we yeah. lost it though, but it was like the jewellery you bought me for my 18th. Yeah. But yeah, I hope that explains a bit more. Feel free to ask us any more questions. You see, a lot of it is just like having the arsehole to do it, innit? Yeah, and it was like our business, obviously, we worked really hard four years running that business, yeah. like working seven days a week. Well, yeah, because we got no kids, it's like we got no tie downs, really. No, except for the babies. Except for the cats, yeah. Our two fur babies, which but, is the other bonus for front of our house. Yeah, because it was, that, was one of the, that, that was one of the things that was like holding us back, because like, we didn't really know what we were going to do with them. Yeah, we didn't want to get rid of them. But luckily, them. when it comes to renting the house out, we, we had a, um, a friend, but it's my sister's best friend, who um, was looking to rent a place, and they, they said about renting ours. And, you look like you've got no hair. Yeah, and I was because white wall behind me. <laughs> yeah, and, and and they said look, they look after the cats as well, so we had a double double bonus really. Yeah. So we are going to start off travelling with twenty grand. So we're going to have an account, aren't we? Is that is that what it is? It's going to be twenty grand. We put a few grand aside for when we come back. Yeah. So obviously, look, you need money, and I'm keeping my car as well, so that'll be here when we come yeah, back. We, and obviously, we're going to come back to a house and stuff, so we're not going to come back. Come, yeah, like nothing. Yeah. Yeah. And we've got like guaranteed work when we come back. If we come back, we might want to yeah, live we somewhere might, else. We might, we might, we might. If we can, we might work abroad. I don't know how hard it is to work abroad. But yeah, on the first day we go traveling, we'll screenshot our bank account and show you the money in there, like how much we're going traveling with. And we're going to try and do like a monthly update of how much we spend, what yeah, prices yeah, yeah. are, and if 20 grand is enough to travel for a year. 
We don't know. We won't run out, but we're yeah, going to have mean, to be careful the first, I like, spend money. Like, obviously, we're going to go do America and um, some expensive countries, but the majority of the ones we're starting are cheaper countries. So I oh, know, but you know it's look when it's cheap, you're like, oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, we spend a bit more on this. Yeah, no, we're not gonna, hopefully, we're not going to be like that. Yeah, and we're going to try and do the air miles, but I don't really get it. So we're trying to do credit card air miles. Yeah, we'll try to. No. Alright, that's it. Thanks for watching. <laughs>